Hi there, welcome to another training video from FinaleMusicLessons.com. This question was sent in via Twitter by Art Greenberg, and he asks, how do you assign different Garretton instruments to different layers of the same staff? Uh, Finale 2012 actually makes this very easy. And uh, so the first thing we need to do is um, actually go to MIDI Audio and activate the Garretton instruments to begin with. So MIDI Audio, play Finale through VST. Click on that. Actually make sure that your instruments are being sent to Garretton in the first place. I always like to go back to MIDI Audio, VST Banks and Effects, just to make sure that the ARIA player is listed under the VST instrument, which it is. Finale usually does this for you automatically. I always like to check anyway. This just is saying that the first 16 channels of MIDI are being sent to Garretton's ARIA player. It is. So we can close that off. And then the next thing you need to do is go to the new score manager that is in Finale 2012. And a uh, couple ways to do this on a PC, you can click uh, Control K. On a Mac, you can click Command K, or just go to Window, Score Manager. And the Score Manager pops up. Uh, right now, if you look under Instrument, Instrument List tab, now you see I, I actually don't have a staff name or anything. I want that to be a flute. Uh, in this case. So I'm going to go to Woodwinds, double click on Flute. If you notice over here the flute name shows up automatically. The name of the flute, the device, Garretton Instruments is selected and the sound is Flute Player 1. So I could play right now and I would get a flute coming out of both of those layers. But we actually want a different layer, a different sound to come out of layer 2. So you come back over here to this arrow click on it and drop down box shows up you can actually put six different channels six different sounds through each of these different options so the four layers could have a different sound the chords expressions all of them could have a different sound six different sounds coming out of the same staff um, in this case we have a layer one and a layer two if you see layer one has flute player one already listed so layer two, we would just come over here, and normally we might select flute player two, and uh, you could just do that woodwinds flute player two. Double click on that if you notice now, flute player one is assigned to layer one. Flute player two is assigned to layer two. That's great, um, but I could play that and it would it would sound fine. It would sound great, but let's just say we're going crazy, and uh, let's click a keyboard and a harpsichord for that sound. Now I don't know why you'd ever put those two instruments by themselves together, but this will at least give us a great opportunity to make sure that we have the two different sounds. So I can click out of that and now let's hear what we've come up with. I mean, not the best combination of two sounds I've ever heard, but at least you get the picture that the flute was playing layer one on top, the harpsichord was playing layer two on the bottom. And that is how you assign different Garretton sounds to different layers in Finale. If you have more questions about our training, private lessons on Finale, please go to FinaleMusicLessons.com. We'd love to hear from you. FinaleMusicLessons.com. Thanks.